Okay, well, let's start at the top, okay? All these people have been recommending hot sauce to me, and this shit is... I'm going to keep it straight one hundo, okay? All these people are recommending a shitload of types of sauce to me, and I want to try all of them, and they're fucking expensive. So, if I try them on stream, I can count them as a business expense. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. Hmm? So, that's what I'm going to do. Uh, now, if you don't mind, I'm trying to find my... <laughs> Thank you. Oh. Give me a second. I'm a pro streamer. Uh, no, I don't have it. I'll, I'll, yeah, I'll fill up your Kraken soon. Just a sec. I'm just trying to sort out my scenes because I added all these fucking scenes and I don't usually fuck with this stuff. For good reason. You know, who the fuck wants to do this? Computers suck. Okay. Anyway, yeah, try them on stream. They're expensive. Uh, so why not? I don't see why not. It's not like there's any fucking sick games to play anyway. You guys are always playing Final Fantasy XIV. And I'm playing PoE. Come on, man. Look around. You know? Fuck it. So... I got a shitload of stuff here. Like, well, here's what I got. Here are my props. I got a spoon. I don't know if I'll need it. <laughs> I'll just you. finger the, the hot sauce. I'll tongue it. I got a sippy cup full of milk here, which I'm going to have some of right now. I got, I'm going to have to drink this faster than slow because I like milk to be chilled. And, you know... Also, let me just make it clear. This isn't some fucking challenge. This isn't some fucking episode of Jackass or any of that bullshit where I do stupid fucking stuff to put myself in the hospital. Fuck no. Don't get the wrong idea, bitch. This is a fucking I like spicy food and want delicious meals. And I want to not have to pay for them full price. So I'm doing them at work so I can fucking business expense them. All right? Don't get any ideas. None of this Johnny Knoxville. You know, I'm not going to do anything fucking stupid. If you recommend some shit that puts me in the hospital, it's fucking curtains. I'm inadvertently hurting you. Thank you. Okay? I'm not even fucking kidding. I mean business. So, now that that's out of the way. Uh, hey, thanks, Medik, Be Weenie, Chinesey. <laughs> Thank you. And thanks, Whisper Draw. I should probably catch up on this. My milk is getting warm. Ah. Mm, thanks, <laughs> Ultimate Nightmare Thank and you. No Country for Old D's Nuts. Uh, Malice <laughs> Jack and. Thank you. Um, uh, Mousy Dong. Thanks, bros. All right. Thanks, Komei <laughs> and Barrett Ashby, Thank you. The Goat, Yellow Name, Zoran. Mythic and Face, <laughs> Dominant, Ghost of... Oh, yeah, I already thanked you. All right, that means there isn't that much thanking left. Hey, good shit, Matt1228. Nice laugh. Uh, face, NC, and... Uh, uh, man, that was fucking funny. I didn't know there were all those flavors. That blew my mind. I thought they only had the stuff, the leave-in conditioner. Papa John's leave-in condition. <laughs> Thank hey, who you. didn't I thank? Hey, what's up, Rip? Thanks, man. Man, you're, the games you've been making lately have been so whack, dude. Get with the program. All right? The game, Rip's <laughs> games have gone thank downhill. You. you know, the pandemic and all. Hey, thanks, Rip. Thanks, Candy Cane and Grey Beast and Doth Rocky and Bad News Panda and Blunt Lung. Mm. Now let me tell you what I have. I got the milk. I got the you spoon. know I've never liked I got you. two Papa jars. John watching smile. I got two. I got a lot of stuff here. I don't know if I'm gonna. I'm probably not gonna be able to take even sample all of it. There's so much shit here. So we'll see. And it depends on how hot they are. You know I don't know. So I got I got two jars of this jam style pasty style hot stuff. I'll tell you what each one is. But anyway, I'm just giving you an idea. There's two jars of this. It's kind of like, this one looks kind of like oily. You know, like it's called Fly by Jing 
Shish Guan Chili Crisp. That's what it's called. It was recommended by a pretty girl from the chat. I forgot her name. Uh, but whatever, I thought I'd give it a shot. You ever tried this? <laughs> it's going too fast. What'd you Thank say? You. My wife recommended that one? Hey, nice wife. All right. Well, we'll see about that. But so far, nice wife. Mm, okay, and then I got this one right here. Uh, track Lemons Fresh Chili Jam. So I got these two. These are jam-like. Um, I have to figure out how to do this. And then this this isn't going to be hot, but it's it was expensive. Gourmet Chipotle Ketchup. Melinda's. You ever heard of this? It could all of these could be trash. That's why I'm trying them on stream so I don't fucking have to pay full price for this garbage. What do I know, dude? Who knows what that guy's wife's mouth likes in her mouth? You know? How do I know? I'm about to find out. Who knows? Everyone's different. She recommended it, but who knows what she likes in there? So, that's my point. <laughs> Thank you. That was a funny uh, thing to say for you guys to respond. I saw like five funny responses from you. Anyway, uh, I got other stuff. So, I got this. This was ridiculous. This is some gourmet mustard. It's called Lovensumf. Loven. It's not even an O. It's one of those O's with that bullshit on top. And then there's a W, Lowenzenf, Lowenzenf, extra, <laughs> extra, and then there's a word written here, but I don't, S, C, that looks like a K, <laughs> A R F extra scarf <laughs> what what the fuck is that whatever that is this has a lot of it what is that <laughs> thank you scarf <laughs> what scarf I never heard of scarf Extra spicy mustard? It means extra hot? Well, it was extra expensive. Extra <laughs> scarf? Thank you. I never heard of scarf. That's a funny thing to say. I like that. Extra scarf. That one was expensive. I think that jar was like 20 bucks, dude. Clap minus 20. But you know what, though? At the end of the day... If I put this thing next to the John McClane skin oh, in fucking Call of Duty, <laughs> come on, which one of you is not going to reach Thank for you. the scarf? I paid 20 bucks for Bruce Willis in Call of Duty. That was garbage. That was worse than garbage. This could be good. I'm finna find out. And both were tax deductible. So... Here's the rest of the story. So the rest of the story, those are the obscure, not sauce related things that I'm gonna put in my mouth today. These, this was, this is called Mer Famous Marie Sharps. And it came in a pack of one, two, three, four, five, six. Six hot sauces. And they're all different flavors and probably different heat levels. They all look really hot. And I'm nervous about these ones. Have any of you tried Marie Sharps? See, the thing is, I love spicy food. But there is a really clear line in the sand. And 
Some foods, some things, it's just ridiculous. This is ridiculous. What the fuck is this? Poison? You know? Like, you know, when you put soap in your mouth or something, immediately your brain sends the signal, okay, this is designed to taste this way, so I don't eat it. It's poison. Get it out of my mouth. Spit, 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 right? That's how it feels when you eat some fucking hot sauce. Like, okay, I'm a human. I have a brain signal sent. Don't put that in your mouth. So I don't want that. And I'm concerned that some of these sauces might be on that level. But I have six flavors of this. <laughs> Thank you. Okay. And I'm more excited. I don't know about that one. I'm excited about it. But this one, I got three flavors of this. It's Mama called... Mia. Papa John's with extra scarf, homie. It's called Palo Alto Firefighters Hot Sauce. And on the bottle, it says that it's made by firefighters who grew a garden in their fire station. And it had peppers in it, and they used that, that pepper stuff. And it was recommended by someone. It's made by buff dudes, yeah, who work hard. So I got three flavors of this. They're all different. Um, so what do you think? I don't know. They are all, by the way, all these hot sauces are either habanero, uh, Carolina reefer, or uh, nothing below habanero, ghost pepper. All these hot sauces are all like ghost pepper reefer level shit. So it's not like any of these is going to be like Taco Bell shit. But then on the other hand, none of them seem to have any like, Schofield, like, that's like the barometer uh, of how hot it is. And I would think, <laughs> now keep in mind, I don't really read. Thank you. It could be written somewhere here and I don't see it. But I don't really see anything like that. If it were dangerously hot, maybe, uh, maybe it would be on here. Milk is getting warm. Let's see how warm. It's still good. Okay, I'm just stalling. Well, what do you want to do first then? That's pretty much my whole uh, repertoire. What do you want to look at first? <laughs> you want to eat first? Thank you. The firefighter one? The scarf? Wow, a lot of scarf. Okay, let's do the scarf. All right, I'll do that. Lowen's Ven Extra Scarf. Extra hot mustard. The color, <laughs> it you. looks fancy. And the color of the mustard seems to be... Hmm. It's like Grey Poupon. It's, it's green. <laughs> it's not green for me. It's only green for you. It's like Grey Poupon so far. It smells like it. And the cons consistency is just like Grey Poupon as well. Yeah, I like that. It's really smooth and creamy looking. Wow, that's a little too much. There's no reason to get crazy, amigo. I'm excited. Okay, I'm going to try it. Yeah, it smells so familiar. Like, I can already taste it from the smell. Tastes just like... Grey Poupon. I'm going in. You know, I've never liked you, Rip. Give these sauces the judge as. That's a fucking rip-off, dude. That is straight up the reason why I'm doing this shit on stream. That's a fucking rip-off. Right there. 20 bucks?! Let me get Bruce Willis in Call of Duty. I changed my mind. That's a ripoff. That's not even as good as Grey Poupon. It's, it, first of all, it's not even as hot as Grey Poupon. Second of all, it has a little bit of, like, kind of, I don't know if it's a mayonnaise kind of thing, or maybe there's some egg in there. Because, you know, mayonnaise has raw egg in it. 
maybe there's some egg or something about it. No, no, it's something that is not there when, maybe it's the scarf. <laughs> I think you can really taste the scarf. And you know what? Nah, I'm not a scarf kind of a guy. You could taste the scarf. Too much scarf. Yeah, you're right. Uh, it's not, it's so disappointing. This has to be the most disappointing shit because it was expensive, named something exciting, extra scarf, it says extra all over it. To me, it's Grey Poupon shits on this and I don't even like Grey Poupon. That's like it's my seventh most favorite mustard. I like it, but nah. It's not even hot. It's too bad, man. No yes Do not buy. Do not buy. For a code brown. I would say do not buy. All right, what do you guys think? Next, that was incredibly <laughs> disappointing. Thank you. That was a total fucking Bruce Willis situation. John McClane, right there. That was a total fucking waste. That shit's gonna sit on. I, I'm throwing that out. <laughs> Fuck. I'm never gonna reach for that instead of my favorite mustard. There's n I'm never going to reach for that jar. No matter what meal I'm eating, I'm never, ever going to reach for that jar before my favorite mustard. I'm going to give that shit to my mom. I'm going to give that shit to my mom. Palate cleanser. I think milk ought to cut it. Okay. That was <laughs> so disappointing. I can't believe it. I'm shocked. Okay, okay. Next up, what do you guys think? It's up to you. I have no preference. Mom, if oh, I have to mom, intervene, I'll let you know. Okay. The jam? Two Silver Springs Jalapeno Mustard out of 10? Dude, <laughs> yeah. Silver Thank Spring you. is my favorite yellow mustard. On a hot dog, I'll put Silver Spring Jalapeno. If it's there, it's my favorite mustard. I love that Silver Spring Jalapeno Mustard. It's good. And my favorite relish is Ragin' Cajun. It's, it's relish made out of jalapenos. No pickles. Shit was tight. I got two, three jars right now. Just in case. You never know backup. Anyway, which one do you want to try? The jelly, you said? This one? Uh, fresh chili jam. Track lemons. Fresh chili jam. <laughs> Thank you. Wow. This is not going well. So far, this is not going well. This fucking stinks. You're oh. my favorite just chatting stream. Oh, 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 oh. What's in this? I don't want to put this in my mouth. I don't want to put this in my mouth. My friend, shut up. This is also like, I think this is like, it had to be more than 12 bucks. I don't remember. It's not expired. It's fresh. Oh my gosh. Hold on. Hey, sorry I'm not thanking everybody. I'm trying to stay focused here, but I really appreciate all of you. And I hope you're all having a great day. It's all good. Man, this fucking stinks, dude. Uh, yeah, I spent over a hundred bucks on all this shit, if you're wondering how much it all cost. So, <laughs> thank you. It, let me tell you what it looks like. It looks like really loose jam. Fruit jam. Uh, stir it? No. You think? Why don't I just shake it? Maybe I should stir it. Mix it. Okay. Okay, I'm just gonna like, I hope this doesn't like, do it over this. All right, all right, that's a really good shake. I think it's gonna be definitely stirred up. No spilling. Oh, 
I hate this smell. Let me tell you what it smells like. I don't know what's in this, but first of all, I don't like eggplants. I hate eggplants. I think they're slimy and I think they stink. This smells like cooked eggplants and the the V word that has the N word at the end of it. Smells like that combined. You know, it doesn't smell good. You know, the acidic uh, liquid that is often used in cooking. You know, people like to superimpose shit. I ain't trying to get, like, you know, accused. Anyway, I'll be honest with you. I don't want to eat this. I want to throw this out. I mean, your nose is your first taste. It's telling me not to eat this. Oh, I don't want to put this in my mouth. So I'm just not going to do it. This stuff sucks. I'm not going to eat it. It sucks. It already tastes like shit. I'm not going to eat it. Fuck you. You eat it. Fuck you, man. I'm not going to eat it. it it's like, uh, I don't want that in my mouth. No way. I'm just not going to eat it. Simple as that. This is not some challenge shit. This is... A fuck you situation. I'll do whatever I want. Why the fuck would <laughs> I put you. something in my mouth that doesn't seem pleasant? <laughs> you guys got a lot Thank to you. learn. Uh, anyway, Kogan, Ryu, thanks. Damn, there's so many of you I missed. Can we just call it even? Thanks, though. I really do appreciate every one of you. That was like 30 minutes of thanking. Yeah, ON2 so far. I'm not happy about that. So far, this is not going well. Um, what's the what's the next one on the chopping block? Oh, you said the other jam? Uh, excuse me. You might like it, though. You. All right, fuck it. Eris is here. All right. I'll try it. Fuck you. I'm going to try it. I paid for it. I'm going to try it. <laughs> I'm trying a little bit. I mean, it's like it's a drop. I'm trying a drop down, of unfortunately. it. R.I.P. It's awful. It's terrible. I need to wash that shit down. It's awful. It tastes exactly <laughs> how it smells. Thank you. Extremely sweet. Like eggplants. Awful fucking flavor. Terrible, terrible, terrible. F. Oh, I need... I, I, the mustard beat that by ten times. The mustard was just disappointing. That was terrible. I hated it. I want to drink more milk. I better make sure this is tight. I don't want any spilling. Oh, that was awful, dude. Wow. You know what's cool? What I take away from that? <clears throat> my mind told me don't eat that you won't like it and I was right I did it anyway because you know I got peer pressured into it but at least that's like my brain is still it still knows that means my nose is like a fucking top level and I I, I agree hey what's next <clears throat> I always think that I have a really great like superhuman level uh, sense of smell. I can smell, dude. I can. S I'm telling you, man. No pants was there. I've smelled our way to churros from like a mile and a half away. I found these churros. Anyway, <laughs> Thank uh, you. what's next? The other jam? That's a good idea. This is that dude's wife's recommendation. It's called Fly By Jing Shishguan Chili Crisp. And it looks like those 
You know when you go to like Korean barbecue or whatever, there's like a like an oily type of chili paste shit. It looks kind of like that. That oily style chili sauce. Very oily. Chili oil. Yeah, that's it. Hot oil. I'm going to kind of stir it up over here. This one definitely needs a stir. Because it settles a lot. Uh-oh. Better not be opened. What are you guys, uh... <laughs> yeah, thank uh, you. Being perverts? That's cool. All right. Wow. Super runny. Wow. This is really liquidy. Woo. 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 That's a very nice smell. Wow, what a nice smell. It smells like, you know, when you're like, imagine those those shin ramens that are like a really high end shin ramen. You know, the ones I'm talking about that are like in a pack with a powder. You know, when you open the the pack of the powder and you put it on the soup before you're making it, the way the powder kind of sends this smell into your nostrils, it's exactly that smell. Like a really good quality, spicy shin ramen smell. Very nice smell. I'll give you that. Okay. Let me make sure this spoon is clean so that I don't have any more of that nasty shit on it that I just fucking put in my mouth. What'd you say? Hey, what'd the guy say? Uh, get some of the chunks on the spoon. Okay, I, I'll try. That's the thing. I'm concerned because the chunks are all the way at the bottom. Dude, Dave's gourmet rules. What'd you say? I want this spoon to be cleaner. I'm very, you know, maybe you guys don't know, but I'm finicky about this kind of shit. This spoon needs to be fucking clean. <laughs> you know? Stir it up. I, sh I just shook it up. I shook the shit out of it right now. Did you just get here? All right, all right. Uh, okay, I'm submerging the spoon in. And there is quite a bit of crunch under it. Uh, yeah, I see what you mean. There's a lot of stuff in here. So it's very runny and oily. But at the bottom, there is quite a bit of what looks to be spicy stuff. So I'm getting, honestly, a little bit too much. Okay, no spilling. Not a drop. This looks like too much. This looks like too much. Okay, okay, a little bit less. Okay, a little bit. That's good. Keep in mind, I got like 10 fucking sauces waiting. I'm getting another napkin. I don't want to spill. Not a drop. <laughs> Thank you. Drag and drop! Wow, it smells so nice. What a pleasant smell. Hey, uh, you got a nice mouth on you. That guy's wife. Hey, nice mouth. Hold on. Well, nice nose so far. I'm going in. It smells nice. Hmm. It tastes very similar to what I, I expected. But I feel like it's not enough. It's like what I said. It's very similar to ramen. Shin ramen. But I want more. I want more of it. It seems mild. Maybe it needs soy sauce or salt. Maybe this needs salt. So I feel like if this had salt, it would be a lot better. It needs salt. It's good. 
The flavor is just as I said, like Shin Ramen. The chunks, they're not really... Not hot. The chunks yeah. are the flavor. Not hot enough. Yeah, not hot enough. Not hot enough. But that's okay, it's almost hot. It's hot. It's just not... It's kind of like I got excited by the smell and the taste. I wonder if I really need to dig out the chunks. Uh, but, you know, even if I do dig out the chunks, it's still going to need salt. I think it needs salt. But I'll tell you this. There's no way I'm not going to eat this. It's good. That's what I think I'm going to do is I think I'm going to try and get rid of some of this oil. It's just too runny. Yeah. Excuse me. Maybe if you could get rid of some of that oil, it would really, you know, uh... Do a titty grabbing gesture with the flavor. You know what I mean? Leave the oil? Well, I mean, I'm just saying. Well, anyway, yeah, I think it's good. I just think it's not that great. Like, I'm not jumping for joy. It's just like, all right, that's pretty good. I'll eat it. I'll eat it. I'll give it like, I'll eat it. What's the name? The all eat it one is called Fly by Jing Shishguan Chili Crisp. It was recommended to me by that Blue Name's wife. Nice wife, dude. I like it. What's next, bros? We're getting all the easy stuff out of the way. I feel like everything after this point is going to get crazy. Firefighter. Hmm. All right, well, let me tell you what your options are, because there are three of them. There are three of these. They're called Palo Alto Firefighter Hot, hot Sauce. The three options are Habanero Pepper Sauce. That's this one. Oh, they're in order. Okay. The first one is just called pepper sauce. This one's pepper sauce. Okay. This one is habanero pepper sauce. And this one is ghost triple X ghost pepper <laughs> pepper sauce. And it's got these white peppers on it that look like ghosts they're white and to be honest with you this triple x with those white ghosts it almost it's kind of dark in here it almost looks like kkk <laughs> kkk thank you ghost pepper sauce Ooh. KKK ghost pepper sauce, dude. All right, which one? Uh, which one am I trying? Keep in mind, if this is too hot, I can abort at any time. <coughs> which one is it? The KKK one is the hottest one. What'd you say? It's trash. Really? Have you had it? In order. I didn't see what you said. Are you just saying it's trash because that's what you say about everything? At this point, you're like a bot. No matter what game, even if it's not a game. Are you even there? Uh, anyway. KKK first? It's going to be too hot. <laughs> I don't want that. <laughs> Thank you. It's the first two are a different color and the third one they came in a pack I wouldn't have gotten this one this is not the one I want okay so I'm not gonna try it I'm gonna try the mildest one okay I'm gonna try the mildest one it's yeah actually maybe let me just smell it let me just smell it okay let's go by smell this is just pepper sauce this smells <laughs> like you. 
t exactly like Taco Bell's hot sauce, but homemade. Hold on. Smells like Taco Bell hot sauce. I like Taco Bell hot sauce, in case you don't know. But, I mean, you know, it's like Doritos. I'm going to have a little swig. Hmm. Very good. Delicious. Delicious. It's much better than Taco Bell hot sauce. Delicious. Ooh, it's nice and hot. That ghost pepper is going to fuck me up. This is nice and hot. This is a very nice hot sauce. Ooh. Sorry about all the smacking. It's hot. Uh, but it's good. I would definitely eat this. No question about it. I can't wait to eat this. I can't wait to eat this. It's delicious. It tastes like the flavor of Taco Bell hot sauce is there, but... It's not smooth. You can taste the peppers. The chunks are on your tongue. So when you, when you take a little swig, the chunks, the little textures, you can taste them on your tongue. When it goes down the hatch, there it's not like liquid, you know? It's called Palo Alto Firefighters Pepper Sauce. I, it came in a three-pack. And all this shit is available on Amazon, by the way. I ain't trying to go to your shitty-ass website, you know? All this stuff is on Amazon. Though I don't have any kind of links or anything. I'm just telling you in case you want it. Uh, no links. What was I going to say? Oh, yeah, pepper sauce. This is the mildest of the three flavors that I got. I'll tell you that I feel like I could easily... Take, hey, shoot the fucking guy. Oh, is that a link for this? Hey, fuck you. Beat that guy's ass. Everyone else knows how to fucking Google. Fuck you. Um, you filled up my whole chat room. Anyway, it's delicious. I love it. I love it. It's good. Huge contrast to the previous shit. All right. A little bit of milk. What happened? Was it the same guy? Anyway. Uh, okay, so. Mm, I guess I should just go in order, right? I don't need the hottest one now, do I? All right. I'm going to do the hottest one now. And then. Oh, I'm going to cliffhang the hottest one. It's break time pendejo. Try the ketchup before you blow your ass out. I'm not going to blow my ass out. You're just writing a fanfic. Uh, <laughs> you are going to blow you. my ass out. Uh, thanks, Bloomer. Keep that shit to yourself. What do you think? Cliffhang? <laughs> Thank you. It's break time, Pendejo, and I think that's probably the way to go. I'm going to skip over medium. I just tried mild. I'm going to skip over medium, which is habanero, and I'm going to go straight to ghost pepper, and I'm going to pray. This says XXX, ghost pepper hot sauce, and it has these white, <laughs> has these white colored peppers that looks like that look like ghosts so that makes this <laughs> xxx <laughs> look a lot like a kkk i'll be honest so this is some racist shit it seems i'm totally kidding i don't need a bunch of fucking firefighters at my door so you're calling us racist huh hey i don't want no trouble i'm just making fucking jokes all right don't get bent out of shape you fucking firefighters and thanks for fighting <laughs> fire thank you they're heroes you know they are. Anyway, I'm taking a break, pendejo, before things get ugly. I'm also going to refill my milk. Bigot sauce. No, this is the bigot sauce right here. 
This is the biggest sauce. The one in the middle. Papa John's conditioner. Sleeve in. All right, all right. <coughs> <coughs> Thank you. That was not that hot. I could easily handle that. No problemo. Easy. I just don't know about the ghost pepper. That shit's some, it's some bigot shit. I'll be back. Let me get about five to seven. Where the fuck? I guess I don't need to do anything, right? <laughs> Thank you. I can just leave it like this. You're just like the, what do you call the guys who are sitting there in the court? The guys who have to all rise? You guys are those guys. It's not the audience, right? Well, anyway, I'm I'm gonna go in my chambers and not the jury, you dumb fucks. The other people, the jury are the jury. God, you guys are fucking moron. The jury, get out of here. Murder eating pizza off the floor. I'll be back in uh, five minutes or something like that. Five to seven. Poof. Good break. Uh, you know, during the break, I was thinking about and looking at the different boxes of this shit, <laughs> and Thank I you. think that I grossly miscalculated the price of everything altogether. I think this was easily over $130 of hot sauce and shit. At least. It's around 130 bucks uh, total. And so far, we're looking at, I mean, that crisp stuff was solid. The hot sauce was great, and the other stuff was trash. The mustard, I'm going to give to my mom. She'll like it. And it's just regular whatever. Too much scarf. <laughs> Thank you. And then the other stuff was, t I didn't even want it in my mouth. I'm going to throw, I'm going to break that. Psh, fuck this stuff. I'm not just going to throw it away. I'm going to break it. Uh, thanks, Tin Man. And Slayer Rocks, there's a lot of people that didn't get thanked today. <laughs> Thanks, your wife's mouth. You know, I've never liked you. <laughs> the bigot sauce has extra vinegar. Hey, don't say that. Uh, thanks. Thanks, Grey Poupon. Uh, he didn't even misspell it. Regular spelling. Yeah, I swear. I'm looking at it right now. No misspelling. Well, anyway, let me stay focused. You, I promised you I would have the ghost bigot sauce. So I'm going to have it. Uh, I refilled my uh, milk fresh, ice cold. I'm going for it. I'm going to shake it first. Okay, I shook it. I'm opening it up. I'm not happy about this. Huh. <laughs> Thank you. It does not smell dangerous. It does not smell dangerous at all. It smells welcoming. <laughs> it, in Thank fact, you. the good news is, I'll just give you what's going on in my head. It smells just <laughs> like the Thank last you. sauce. Very similar. Right near that flavor profile, scent profile. It's like the last one. Now that's good news because I thought the last one was delicious. And that must mean that all of the sauces that these guys make have a consistent like flavor profile. Uh, but this has bigot ghost <laughs> peppers Thank on you. it. So, who knows? I'm going to go for it. Yeah, I'm, I'm only having a little, little, you know, I'm not taking a big swig. Just a little swig. I'm going for it, bros. Got a little on my mustache. <laughs> Thank uh, you. Give me a sec.
Sorry about the smacking. <laughs> uh, it's hot, but not dangerous. It's a little spicy, though. Just give me a sec. I'm uh, processing it. It's hot, but not dangerous. It's good. I think that the other one was also hot. So here's what I'm telling you. <laughs> the trophy's mine! I think that... Snorted for the real effect. Yeah, yeah, shut up. And thanks. Um, if the mildest one was actually mild, I might be pretty zapped by this. But to be honest, even the mild one was also pretty hot. I would say this one is a little bit tart for my taste compared to the other one. It, it, the guy who said the V word that has the N word at the end of it, he was kind of right in the sense that it does have a lot of that. It's got a lot of that flavor. Too tart for me. And the spice level, honestly, it is hot, but... I'm gonna get a little more. You think that's a bad idea? It's ah fuck it. I'm gonna have a little more. It's um this is the triple X ghost pepper sauce. Just a little bit. Hmm. It's good. It's good. Yeah. It reminds me of the Taco Bell sauce, but if it were, ooh, it's hot. It's hot, but it's good. I would eat this, no question about it. It's hot though. Sorry about the smacking. I'm starting to feel it in my bald spots. <laughs> Woo! Uh, it's good. Hey, this stuff's good. This one's a little bit tangy. I'd have to retry the other one and kind of, you know, figure them out. But I'm, I'm going to eat this. It's good. And I may buy it again. It's hot, though. So you probably need food. Without food, just straight, the way I drink it, I don't know if you would like it. But I like it. I like it. I should have some milk. I forgot about that. Dude, come on. That tells you right there. There's no reason for me to not drink milk. I just took two swigs of ghost pepper sauce. And I forgot that I have milk here. Oh, that's convenient. All right. Yeah, it's not that hot. Do you think I should even try this? It almost feels like whatever. Because I just went from mild to ghost. Why would I try habanero? Yeah? All right, I guess. Okay, I will. Come on. Thanks. Move to Korea tomorrow. Can you spare some huck? <clears throat> yeah, man. You don't. I don't think you're gonna need any more than a regular day's worth of luck, dude. There's a lot of people out there who need luck real bad. You got it. Easy. That's gonna be easy, man. Don't worry about it. Uh. Anyway, what are we? Uh. What are we talking <laughs> about? You. Sorry, I'm not thanking everyone one by one. You know, I'm trying to do uh, stay focused and do what I'm doing here. But I appreciate all of you, even the ones that I don't like. I appreciate you too. Uh, anyway, are we going for medium? Fuck it, man. I'm not worried. Oh, excuse me. Woo! Breathing fire. <laughs> oh. Um, uh, what was I talking about? Jesus Christ. <laughs> Ghost pepper hot sauce, huh? Um, my <laughs> bald spots are Cleveland steaming right now. Hey, Billy Hoyle, thanks, dude. Thanks for the $20 reduce. And thanks, every one of you that didn't get thanked. Double thanks. I'm going for the habanero. Oh, I didn't shake. I gotta remember to shake. Please try to remind me if I don't go for a shake. Because, you know, shaking the sauce really can make a big difference on your review. You gotta, like, uh, 
Give it a shake. You can't re really taste it unless you do. Thank you. Fair shake. You know? <laughs> Thank you. Wow, this is so much like Taco Bell sauce. So, uh, this this reminds me so much of Taco Bell sauce, but if it were homemade. Not like if you knew the recipe and you can make it. The... Is eating hot sauce when high a bad idea? It's much hotter than <laughs> Taco you. Bell sauce, though. Much, much hotter. Way hotter. Okay. Delicious. Flavor-wise, this is the best one. I'm glad I didn't skip it. As far as flavor goes, this, to me, is very, like roasted it's got like a roasted pepper kind of like a chipotle habanero delicious i think this is good all three of them are good it's called palo alto firefighters pepper sauce i hope you know i don't have anything to do with these fucking guys other than that i appreciate firefighters putting their lives on the line to save kitty cats and put out fires if you live in Southern California, you know how dangerous fire can Thank be. You. That shit will turn the entire sky orange and cover your entire car in dust. Like it's some post-apocalyptic shit. For real. It's like some Book of Eli shit. Except <laughs> not Thank a you. terrible movie. With really good actors in it. Anyway, uh, what were we talking about? Oh yeah, it's good. It's good. I don't have anything to do with these cocksuckers, is what I'm hey, saying. Good looking, cute bald spots. It's good. I like it. Palo Alto Firefighter. <laughs> All three Thank flavors are good. I would rank Thank them. You. I would rank them medium. Hey, what are you looking at? Mild. How many Maximilians out of ten? And then Ghost. To me, the Ghost Pepper one was not the best one because. It, it had a lot of the, you know, V word in it. <clears throat> and I don't like when it's overpowered by the V word. Uh, anyway, thanks, Anno D's Nuts and Destroyed Kitten and Kavik. Thanks, Capsaicinette. Damn, what up, girl? Thanks, Spicy Pepperoni and Kimball, Adrogar, New Stoner, Super Mute Boy. Uh, thanks, what the book and e Echo, and thanks again, Billy Hoyle. Mega thanks. Okay, so I gotta tell you something else. Because I'm consuming <laughs> Thank you. what some would say is pretty hot hot sauce, uh, I'm having uh, reactions, responses, okay? I can feel tears of JOI right here. I don't want to touch my face. Uh, and I can feel some <laughs> other you. shit going on north of the border, okay? Things are happening in my head. So you'll have to, there's going to be noises. I'm going to mute, like right now. Okay, just letting you know. There's re reactions going on here, you know? The stuff's kind of hot. I'm starting to sweat. But it's still not that <laughs> Thank hot. Thank you. If it's going to be that hot, dude, let me get one of those. Easy. Okay, so what's next? We got, the problem is, this next brand... Oh, I also have this Chipotle ketchup. I'm not, I don't think it's going to be good. I think it's going to be a ripoff. You want to try this real quick? Chipotle ketchup? All right, fuck it. Just quick. I think it's not going to be anything special, but I want to give it a try. I was excited. So I'm taking off the little thing. It's just very ketchup-like right now, but it seems very homemade at the same time took off the little thing and it's got like a cap squeeze bottle this was like 15 bucks I think oh man I gotta clean my spoon see that's the thing how am I gonna what do I gotta get a different spoon for every sauce is that how I solve this I can't wash the spoon between tastes ah excuse me whoa <laughs> thank you you know <clears throat> 
Every time I've burped, it's <laughs> felt like I've Thank spit you. fire a little bit. Um, what were we talking about? Uh, oh, yeah, the, this stuff. I'll try it. I'm going to squeeze a little bit of it on my spoon. That's the best way to do this. Oh. <laughs> okay. I didn't spill any, did I? Okay. I'm going for it. <laughs> wow, the smell. Wow. What a crazy smell. You can't shake it. It's too thick. It's like, you know, don't worry about shaking this one. I thought about it, though. It's really thick. It smells. Wow, what a smell. It smells like <laughs> gourmet. Thank you. Nice, like a dry kind of like uh, smoky, really smoky. Super smoky kind of a smell. That's very pleasant. I'm going for it. It's very nice. <clears throat> I think... Uh, It's delicious. It's it's got an interesting kind of a thing going on though. It's delicious. It's better than ketchup. But unfortunately, ketchup itself is just not good enough for it to be worth it. But it's better than ketchup. Let me put it this way. If it tastes gourmet, right? It tastes delicious. I think ketchup is good. I'm not a ketchup hater, but even the best ketchup is not going to be worth <laughs> this much money, Mierda. unfortunately. <laughs> I'm going to eat every drop of this for sure. It's better than regular ketchup. If they were next to each other, I'd reach for this. But ketchup is ketchup, bro. It's not spicy, but it's got a little spice. More than ketchup. Uh, my favorite relish is... Uh, Raging Cajun Jalapeno Relish. And it's relish made out of jalapenos. It doesn't have pickles in it. And it's delicious. That's my favorite relish. Anyway, this one's a hit. I would say this is a hit. I like it. It's better than ketchup, and I like ketchup. It's just like, you know, how, how good could it be unless it's going to be super unique? It tastes like a very smoky and gourmet chipotle ketchup <laughs> which you. is what it is it's it's called melinda's chipotle ketchup and it says no high fructose corn syrup which i fucking love because that's not good <laughs> for my you. gout this is made with sugar so another two thumbs up <laughs> this is a hit thank you this is a hit it's just a little bit too expensive i'll be straight up like a bottle of Heinz, you could get a massive bottle of Heinz ketchup or any kind of regular ketchup for cheap. This was like, I don't know how much this was. It's got to be like, it's five bucks on their site? How big of a bottle? Maybe I got ripped off. It's possible. I got it on Amazon. I feel like I paid at least 10 bucks for it. Maybe more. Same size? Five bucks? Yeah, for sure. I'm down. Yeah, it's good. If you like ketchup and you like Chipotle, it's good. Those two things are very nicely, uh, they're French kissing each other in that stuff. What's the best valued hot sauce? What? I don't know, man. I don't know what you're saying. I got six flavors of... Hot sauce left. These, I mean, I was worried about the firefighter sauces. I was worried about no! these. Decadent scarfy delicious. I'm worried about these two. I got six, no, yeah? Yeah, six. I got six of these. They're all, it came in a pack, okay? It's a variety pack of Marie Sharp's hot sauce. 
every one of them looks ridiculously hot. Uh, did you get the Mad Dog 357 hot sauce? Um, I don't think so. Unless it's coming in the mail. If it's not available on Amazon, I didn't bother. Because, you know, I'm not trying to jump through hoops to fucking get this shit. I'm just gonna fucking Amazon that shit. Uh, anyway, Mar Marie Sharps. Marie Shart. <laughs> All right, I'll give it up. Here are the flavors. Marie Sharp's is goat. Marie Sharp's replaced Tapatio for me? All right, I'm wagging my tail. I'm wagging. But I'm still recovering from the ghost pepper bigot sauce that I just drank. Let me have some more milk. <laughs> Thank you. Marie Sharp. <laughs> okay <clears throat> uh let me tell you what the flavors are and you guys could tell me which ones you want to see in what order and i can't guarantee oh my god the names this one's called marie sharps beware and it's like capital letters huge letters beware comatose heat level Habanero pepper sauce. That's what this shit says. Comatose. Okay, this is the next one. Marie Sharp's habanero pepper sauce. That's all it says. And it's got a heart shape on it. Maybe this one's like mild. This one seems mild. All it says is habanero pepper sauce and it has a heart shape. Okay. This one says, Marie Sharp's Belly Zine Heat, B-E-L-I-Z-E-A-N. I don't know what that is. Heat. And it has, a, it has a heart on it as well. But it seems hotter. I don't know what that is. Oh, from Belize? So it's like Belizean? Belizean? I don't know. I never heard of that shit. Next sauce. Interesting. This one also only says habanero pepper sauce. But it's green. And it has a... Can you spare me double luck today? Sure, man. You can have triple luck, dude. Just don't get into any trouble and don't fucking tell me about the details. I don't want to hear it. If you tell me the details on why you need the luck, maybe loose details are okay. But I don't want to hear that shit, more or less, is my point. All right? Yeah, you got it. Triple. Uh, thanks, everybody. Uh, who I haven't thanked. I appreciate you. This is a different one. It's green. Uh, it's not, the sauce isn't green. Damn, for you, they're all green. The sauce is regular. The label is green. This one label is gold. Man, this is very confusing. A lot of these have a very similar bottle, except the label color is different. They're named the same thing. I wonder if these are, so, then maybe they're like ranked. This one, the sauce itself is actually green. I don't know what to think. There's no like, oh wait, this one's as hot. <laughs> this one's as hot. I thought it was gonna be like a ranking system. Oh, this one says mild. All right, we're getting somewhere. This one says fiery hot. I found the like gauge. This one says beware comatose heat levels. <laughs> And this one says, Belly Zine, whatever the fuck that means. So I'm gonna assume Belly Zine is hot. And I'm gonna assume mild is for babies. So what do you think? The strategy we used for the last group of hot sauces went pretty well. 
I went from the most mild one and then I went to the hottest one. Do you think that's a good idea again? The reason I think that's a good idea is, it beca is because it gives you an idea of what the sauce tastes like so you can prepare. Go blind? What do you mean? Like, don't even look at them? That's weird. This isn't some fucking challenge or some, like... I'm t this isn't some weird shit, dude. All right? Go watch your favorite fucking content creator. I'm just trying to get a deal on hot sauce by making it tax deductible. Fuck you. <clears throat> anyway, so I think I'm going to go with the mildest one first. Let me shake it up. <laughs> Thank you. Okay, I shook it up. Now I'm unhinging it. Woo. Woo. Nice. Smells hot. Also smells pretty Mexican. Like I've had it before. Very familiar smell. This is the mildest one, by the way. It's good. I like the smell. <laughs> Thank you. Okay, I'm going for it. Hmm. <laughs> nice Thank texture. You. Not liquidy. Not too runny. Uh, it's ridiculously mild. Like, so mild. But at least it gives me an idea of what I'm getting into and I would say it tastes good tastes pretty nice not bad and very mild though not not bad so mild okay let me milk it up a little okay one sec I mean I would say that is not even as hot as something like sometimes this shit ramps up you know yeah it's a sippy cup full of milk i got my sippy cup this is actually you know i make smoothies in these sippy cups it's actually what well, you use the you know that ninja i got that ninja for smoothies this is the cup that you put upside down on the ninja to make smoothies <coughs> Excuse me. Whoa. That that bigot sauce I had earlier is causing my burps to spit flames. Uh, anyway. <clears throat> okay, so I went I tried the mild and I'll tell you um yeah, all right. It's hot sauce. I'm going to go all the way to the top though. Well, what's the top? The Blizzian? Or beware comatose heat level. I think beware comatose heat level. Get up in there, will ya? Smile. All right, this one's called beware comatose heat level. We'll see about that. Beware. <laughs> beware sleeping face. <laughs> beware. Whatever. <laughs> all right, all right. Okay. I'm a little concerned, I'll be honest. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> Thank you. Ooh. Ooh. <laughs> Ooh. It smells. You know that feeling when you're like at a party and two people are arguing and someone might pull out a gun? <laughs> Thank you. That's the same feeling I get when I smell this. <sighs> like, is he going to pull out a gun? <laughs> I smell a gun. It smells. Dangerous. That's what it smells like. Not bad, not good, but hot. Red alert. Red alert. Okay? Be ready to run. Be ready. Someone, something could go down right now. Be ready to run. 
All right, I'm going for it. Hold on, let me clear my throat real quick. Just a sec. Keep in mind, I'm, I'm, this is like three hot sauces in, not including all that other weird shit. So, you know, give my face a break. Okay, beware sleeping face. I'm going in. Ooh. Sorry about the smacking. I have to have a little bit more. I, I'm going to be honest with you. I chickened out a little bit. I got some. It's hot. But let me, let me get a little more. Mm. That's hot. Uh, it's getting way hotter. It's getting way hotter. Um, I'm still examining it, okay? Just give me a minute. Because you know you can't speak too soon. It's getting way hotter. Way hotter than it was at first, but it's delicious. It's hot. Oh, <laughs> shit. Thank you. It's hot. Very hot. It's very hot. It's hot. Wow, it gets so much hotter. It gets so much hotter. <laughs> Thank you. It gets so much hotter. Thank you. Dude. It's too hot. It got too hot. It's too hot. It's too hot. <laughs> it's getting way hotter. <laughs> it's too hot. Um. Damn, that is fucking hot. That's hot, but... Yeah, it's still early, you. right? That's hot. Okay. Yo! Wow. Can you need <laughs> Shut up, bitch. Thank you. It's really Thank hot. You. Don't touch your eyes. Don't worry. I was very careful. I got this under control. Um It's hot. Wow, that's hot. That's too hot. No, I don't want that. I don't want that. It's too hot. It's burning my mouth the way it would feel like. Ugh, it's too hot. It feels like I burned my fucking mouth like with with not sauce with like a hot smoldering hot, um, like uh, it's too hot. Fuck you is what I'm trying to say. Fuck you. It's too hot. Ah. It's too hot. I have milk. Hey, I have milk. But don't you think if I have the milk, it's going to dilute the heat level? It's too hot, dude. This is too hot. It's like, it, it feels like my mouth, my tongue... I ate some food that I was too excited about and I burned my mouth. You know that awful feeling you get after you burn your mouth? Your taste buds are <laughs> unable to Thank taste you. correctly? That's how it feels. It feels like I burned my fucking mouth. It's not the hottest thing I've ever had, though. I've had hotter stuff than this where I felt like I should not have had that. And I'm glad this doesn't taste that way. Thanks. That's hot. This is hot. This is the limit. Any hotter than this and I would feel regret. This is the limit. It's physically painfully hot, which is fine. <laughs> I have, I feel like going through gout and having gout has like, dude, gout pain is way worse than anything I ever, anything else. 
fucking root canals, fucking any kind of shot or anything like that. It's way worse. It's comparable to viciously broken bones. You know? Like, it's crazy painful. So, whatever. The point is that it's prepared me for pain in a lot of ways. And to me, this is like whatever i could have more i just don't really see why i should you know it's too much to enjoy i think but it's not too much to regret it's too much to enjoy but not too much to regret i think it's too hot that's hot it still burns but i didn't get milk so that should give you an idea of I don't know. I don't know what you know. I, what do I know about your mouth or your wife's mouth? Nothing. But I gotta blow out my sage jam. This shit's fucking with my entire uh, whatever reproductive system of my sinuses. Hold on. Make it hurt. Two more sips. Who? I mean, poof. Yeah, it was hot. I ain't gonna lie. That was fucking hot. I haven't had milk yet, though. I'm gonna have milk now. <sighs> Thank you. <laughs> that was hot. <laughs> Thank you. Um, no, it's just regular milk. Full. I mean, what's it called? Whole. <laughs> full milk. Is it called full or whole? Whatever. Full whole. <laughs> Whatever the fuck it's called. Uh, anyway. Yeah, it's full milk. Full whole milk. Uh, <laughs> Dude, this shit's hot, man. Too hot. I would not put that on food. That would ruin food. That would ruin the food. The lowest one was... Nah, whatever. Ah. Woo! <laughs> Thank you. Ah. Uh, excuse me. Yo! Smile. Uh, that was hot. So far, my favorite one of the day was the Thanks. medium rolling for living room. The mama bear firefighter one, the medium one. That was my favorite one of the day. That was good. Um, this was hot, dude. I'm sweating. Wow, that's amazing. I'm sweating. I haven't moved a muscle. I just like ran my fingers through my luscious full head of hair. <laughs> and uh, I realized that I am sweating like crazy. You know? Like crazy. Jesus, I've been sitting here not moving a muscle. Yo! <laughs> uh, hey, thanks, Noctis and Truswall, Vape Lad and Chalky Milky, D Girl, uh, Viscant JOI. Well, I got tears of JOI coming out of my ducts right now. Thanks, thanks, everybody. I know I missed a lot of generous. Stoners, and I really appreciate you guys, every one of you. Uh, but you know, I'm busy. Beware sleeping face, it's too hot. It's, I feel like now that the because I drank milk, my mouth is <laughs> recovering, but it's moving up. It was, it's like in my nose, and it's moving to my like eyes, and it feels like it's radiating out of my fucking 
bald spots. It's hot. I didn't have that much either. I guess I did have two swigs. And the first swig was not that big. And then the second swig was pretty confident because the first swig was a dud. The second swig was bigger. And I think... Ugh, excuse me. Ugh, uh, it was too hot. But again, I don't regret it. And I've had hot sauce that was regret hot sauce. Too hot. This is too hot, but I don't regret it. I just wouldn't eat it again. Jesus. Oof. All right, you want to go for some middle tiers? Not even regret. Like I told you, bitch, I'm not trying to fucking do some kind of weird challenge where I, can he stand, do the crazy nut challenge, you know? Check it out on YouTube, click below. No, this isn't that kind of bullshit, dude. I'm trying to find sauce that I'm going to want to put on my fucking food to make it delicious, okay? I'm not trying to fucking do some entertainer shit. This is just a loophole so I can tax deduct this fucking sauce. $130 worth of sauce? I don't think so. I'll just drink it in front of these fucking scrubs and then I'll tax right off. You know what I mean? Uh, anyway, I bought all this sauce, so I'm going to try it. What do you guys think? Should I go with the uh, mama bear? There was that. This one's the other one that's weird. It's called Billy Zine. Did anyone Google that? Billy Zine? I don't know what that is. Billy Zine Heat. Marie Sharp's Billy Zane. It's spelled <laughs> Thank you. B E L I Z E A N. The fuck is that? Is that a made up word? As Waldo. Billy Zine is not my lover. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. I'll give it up. Uh, thanks, 81 Phallus. And thanks, Teabag, a bear trap. And Oni Baku, man. Uh, thanks. You know, I was, I was listening to Michael Jackson today. You know that? Uh, you know what my favorite Michael Jackson song is that's not popular? Like a low low profile one is uh uh the fuck is that song called? It's called uh Why You Always Trip on Me or some shit. That's my favorite one. They're all popular. Yeah, but a lot of people have never heard of that one. It's kind of a low, uh, you know, low one in terms of popularity. But that's my favorite one. But other than that, Smooth Criminal is my favorite dance. Uh, you know, like music videos and that's part of the song, right? I think Smooth Criminal is a great song. But the dance in that music video, the full extended version, the one, there's a part in that video where he's like uh, at the pool hall and they're all dancing together and he's like like doing a confident style walk and then the bully guys walk up to him and he like sees them and moonwalks backwards away from them. That sequence right before they all like do the whole move, that sequence is so sick. To me, I'll never forget that. I'm a huge Michael Jackson fan, in case you don't know. <clears throat> I'm like a really big... I have been since I was a little kid. I had a DVD collection. Anyway, I'm a big fan. I remember my aunt met him one time at the Bellagio, and she sent me a picture. Not a digital picture, mind you. Like, she had a picture. She showed me the picture. I said sent you the picture like I'm used to it now. A real photograph that she took with uh, Michael Jackson. I was so jealous. <laughs> Murder eating food off the floor again, huh? Anyway, uh, are we trying this hot sauce or what? Billy Zine. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. I'm gonna try this Billy Zine stuff. Oh, I didn't take off the wrapper. 
<laughs> Cut that bitch off. Let's call her. Sucking on a chili dog. <laughs> hey, all right. Thank you. Thanks, bros. Sorry I didn't thank all of you. But I'm about to try Billy Z now. Uh, hey, thanks, John. Whatever, and N Fang, and T Bag of Bear Trap, and Itusama, and especially all those people that did not get butt hurt for not getting thanked. There are a lot of you. Sorry about that. It had to be done. But thanks very much. I appreciate you a lot. I'm going for. I'm still recovering from this beware sleeping face. Oh! I'm running dangerously low on cum. <laughs> Fuck. I drank it all already. Uh, all right. I'm going to go for the Billy Zane. Uh, I'm still recovering from the other one. Billy Zane it is. Okay, I'm opening it up. Definitely, I my... That was crazy, dude. My The top of my head is sweating. Fucking weird. Okay, okay. I didn't realize it until I ran my fingers through my bald spots. Wow. These are so... Remember the other ones? Remember when I told you how they smelled? They smelled like Taco Bell sauce. Not dangerous. These smell so dangerous, dude. It literally gives me that feeling you get when you you're something's about to go down. You know, are they gonna are they gonna fight? Are they gonna shoot each other? You know, <laughs> be you. ready to run. That's how it feels. It's so crazy. So very. <laughs> Thank you. I hope it doesn't get on my mustache. I'm gonna go wash my whole fucking face and shit on this next break. This next break's gonna be a long one, okay? Cause I'm I touch my mustache a lot. And I know it's not on my fingers, but it could be on my mustache. And if I touch my mustache and then, you know, you know, God knows what's going to happen. Uh, okay, I'm going for it. <sighs> wow, that stings the nostrils. That goes in your nose and it attacks <laughs> yeah, the inside you. of your nostrils. That stings. This is a stinger. I'm afraid this is hotter than the other one. I'm going to go ahead and smell the other one again. Oh, shit. They're both fucked up. Both of these ones are fucked up and hot. Oh. oh. <laughs> <laughs> Porky pig. This shit's hot, dude. All right. All right. <laughs> All right, I'm going for it. <laughs> hey, thanks. This stream is perverse. That's the idea. I'm going for it. Don't be a chicken shit either, all Hell right? You. Fucking take a... I, I don't want to do two swigs problem. of this. I'm going to do one swig, and it's going to be big <laughs> enough you. for me to not feel like I should go for two, because these types of sauces, they ramp. They go up the handicap ramp, Top speed. All right? Open the door. I'm coming in. They ramp up. I'm going for it. This is... Ch <laughs> this is belly zine. <laughs> Don't touch your face. Fuck. <laughs> Stop laughing. Bitch. Bye. Have a good one, my vanilla gorilla. Cut that bitch off. Next call. <laughs> my right ear started ringing. Holy shit. I can't what believe that. My, friend, shut up. Don't tell me I'm my right ear started ringing. I swear. This sauce is six out of nine Maximilians. <laughs> Thank you. Okay. It tastes good. I'm going to be honest. 
Billy Zine tastes fucking good. It's just that it's really hot. It's delicious. It is. I think it's better than the Beware Sleeping Face one. The Beware Sleeping Face one felt like... It was good, but too hot for how good it is. This one is really hot. <sighs> Excuse me. Oh my god. Uh, what was I talking about? What was I talking about? It's tolerable when you... Sprinkle it instead of dab it? What the fuck is the difference between a sprinkle and a dab? I just... What what did I just do? It's not... Uh, it's alright. It tastes really good. It's hard to tell how hot it is. I'll be honest. I feel like I could have more of it. It's hot though. It's pretty hot. I think the other one might have been hotter. Do you guys know? I think the Beware Comatose Heat Level is hotter than Billy Zine. But I think they're comparable just based on the way they look. Beware is a gimmick? What do you mean by a gimmick? Because it's hot. <laughs> it's too hot for me. I would not put this on my food. I think this would ruin food. But, yeah. excuse me. I think uh, this Billy Zine stuff, it's right on the level where it's, it might ruin food. Because <laughs> it's hot, but it tastes good. Uh, is it as hot as the girls in your chat? No, not even close. Uh, but it is hot. It's definitely hot. I feel like I got electrocuted. Have you ever been electrocuted? Uh, you know that feeling you get where afterwards you kind of feel like it hit you all over it, w it went all the way through you you know that feeling of like it went from you touched it with your finger but you felt it in your toes uh that's how it feels i put this shit in my mouth but i could feel it in my toes uh you know what i mean uh that was pretty hot not regret levels though one time a few years ago i bought this hot sauce that had like an atomic symbol like a biohazard or atomic type of a symbol on it i don't remember what it was called and i literally just tasted it put a little bit of it on my mouth and threw it in the trash i thought it was awful it was almost like, I don't think it was called the bomb, but I'm not sure. Maybe you're right. To me, that hot sauce tasted like if you took everything away from hot sauce except for the most burning, burning sensation. No flavor. No anything. It was just simply the moment it coated your tongue it simply burned through everything destruction all the way through it's like that scene in terminator 2 where she's trying to tell the kids in the playground no she and then the boosh, it's like all her skin gets blown off by a nuclear explosion that happens to your mouth when you had that sauce this is like fucking completely destroyed all your taste buds are like the buildings in that scene paper just destruction that's how that sauce felt none of these sauces feel that way at all none of these sauces have that kind of like this is 
there's gonna be a derelict my mouth will never be the same you know tapatio dude are you fucking kidding me tapatio is like it's like the most basic shit tapatio i'm i used to have a and my friend had one too we both had a keychain tapatio bottle for when you need tapatio on your keychain that's how fucking regular it is like I need Tapatio the way I need a fucking bottle opener or a fucking whatever, you know? What do you, what are, a lighter, you know? Like some kind of Swiss army knife. It needs a Tapatio option. That's how fucking regular of a thing it is. Tapatio. <coughs> this hot sauce was hot. Tapatio is my go-to. Some people like Cholula or that other one. The red one, they're all red, but maybe it starts with a... Yeah, Valentina. Yeah, all that shit. My go-to is Tapatio. I like Tapatio. It's my go-to of the basic... Those are all basic hot sauces, though. Cut that bitch out! To me. Very basic. And not spicy. I had spicy. a wrestling coach give us all some of the bomb. He was laughing his bunnies off. Hey, thanks, Speedy Warp and Gachi Beads. Thanks, Maximilian... Scoville scale? Ah, Jesus, dude. Uh, uh, what'd you say? I don't remember. Thanks, Action Dan and uh, Cali Corleone. Alcoholic Guy Coolion. Lowrider. Thanks, bros. I like this Billy Zine. I think I'm going to try this with food. Uh, I think I'm going to try this with food. It was pretty good. It's called Marie Sharp's Billy Zine Heat Habanero Pepper Sauce. And it's got a heart shape on it, but the heart has flames coming out of it. Uh, I liked it. I want to wash my hands. Uh, I have more, but before I do any of that shit, I'm going to take a break and wash my hands. Habanero has a nice taste. It doesn't always. I feel like you can easily do any of these sauces wrong. And wrong for my mouth. Keep in mind, and I said this earlier, I personally don't like the V word in terms of flavor either. You know the V word. I don't say that word anymore. Times change. Get with the times. All right? That word is unacceptable. Uh, you know that word. The V word, I don't like that flavor. It's too much of a bigot. I can't, I don't like it. So if it's got too much of the V word in it, then I'm out. And some of these sauces are very V wordy. Habanero is better raw. Yeah, all right. Uh, thanks, Speedy Warp. I'm gonna get up and blow out my fucking say jam and <clears throat> Jesus Christ, that shit was too hot. I haven't had anything that hot in a while, though I feel like I'm recovering. There was a moment where it literally felt like I burned my mouth on like a piece of super hot pizza. Like, I, you know, I don't know if this has ever happened to you, but sometimes I'll be so excited about the fucking pizza that I won't even care. And I'll go in and it just burns your entire mouth. It's a disaster. It's a huge mistake. Yeah, calzone. It's even that's an even better example because calzones, calzones, they keep the heat in. You open a calzone, this shit is gonna like smoldering. You know you're gonna get owned. Careful with the fucking calzone, you're gonna get burnt. Calzone. You know what I'm saying? And that's how it felt. It felt like for a moment there. The spice levels felt physically like I got burned. But now I feel okay. It, I, it's just like a little lingering. That's how I knew it was too hot. That was the beware sleeping face one. Uh, beware comatose heat level. That shit fucking was hot. Too hot. Would not have more of that. But the other one I would have more of. And I got a few more to try. <sighs> Myrtle microwaved hot dog. 
Remember that episode of The Simpsons where the hot dog fell on the floor at the Quickie Mart and it was on camera, it rolled on the floor? That's what I thought of. <coughs> this shit was hot. All right, I'm getting up. Uh, five to seven minutes, please. Uh, thanks for joining me so far. Uh, we're going to do a quick recess. Whew. Whew. I mean, poof. Uh, nice break. Shit's fucking spicy, dude. It's not just, like, spicy. You have an entire reaction. <laughs> yeah, thank you. You know, I don't know if you've ever tried anything that hot, but I washed my hands, so I guess I shouldn't worry too much. I also washed my mustache a little bit. That's why it was a little bit longer <laughs> than a you. normal break. Still less than seven, though, like I promised. Uh, thanks. Uh, ROFL, <laughs> Copter, Thank whatever. Thanks for the new Prime. Thanks all the generosity. You know, there's a lot of people here today. Thanks, Dayman and <laughs> yeah, Rangel and Sultan, Wet Dicks, Sizzle Poops, Enfang, Rexum, Speedy Warp. Thanks, bros. Uh, um, you know. Excuse me. Ugh. Uh, are you a judge? Hey, what's up, purple name? Uh, why don't you do me a favor and take two steps to the left real quick? Ah! That's exactly what I'm imagining. Push the fucking button. Get him out of here. Uh, anyway. Um, shut up, bitch. Stupid new question asking. Cock sucking purple name. Uh, what'd you say? I'm feeling great. Uh, I just had some really spicy hot sauce. And though the mouth part of it is over... There are other parts still happening. Like, uh, I don't feel any trouble, but, you know, it was very hot. My my nose and also my ear. The, the moment I drank it, uh, it, uh, my ear started ringing. My right ear, which is so weird. Very weird. Uh, but whatever. <laughs> still good. That's way too hot. <laughs> yeah, I think that's... I don't know how that happened, but it did. My ear started ringing on the right side. It's not now. Did you get any sauces from Hot Ones? I've never watched Hot Ones. I've only seen clips. Uh, these are all recommendations from people in the chat room. And I'll be honest with you. I had a bunch of stuff today, and the one that I loved was this one. No, not this one. <laughs> Thank you. The, this one was delicious and very spicy. It's called the Palo Alto Firefighters Habanero Pepper Sauce. It's like, uh, I don't know, what do I call it? It's hot, but it's very tasty. Very tasty. Smoky and delicious. I would recommend this. It's their medium heat level, though. There's one that's hotter than this. That's called <laughs> Triple you. X Ghost Pepper. And I didn't think it was as good. But none of them were as hot as this fucking Beware one. Comatose heat. The Beware one is ridiculous. Too hot. That's ridiculous. That shit, that shit made the top of my head sweaty. Uh, anyway... Uh, well, there's three untested flavors. I got, this one's actually Chili Verga. It's green. I know to you, all of them are green, but in the real world, we have all types of colors. And if you can't accept that, you're a bigot. This is green. Verga? <laughs> Question mark? Shut up, bitch. Uh, anyway, yeah. Happy birthday to Chupa Maverga. That is so fucking funny, dude. Some Mexican dude pranked some gringo-ass news anchor into wishing Chupa Mi Verga a happy birthday on TV. That is too good. Happy birthday there, 
Chupa Maverga. Have a good one, son. Hey, thanks, Cloud Jr. and Bago F. Lemons. Thanks, Rangel. And everyone I didn't thank today. Yeah, that guy's a legend. Anyway, I'm going to try this green stuff. It's, uh, it's Salsa Verga. Smells hot. <laughs> it smells hot. But it smells good. I'm going for it. Be careful. Ooh, very nice. Mmm. Nice sauce. It's hot. Green habanero pepper sauce. It's not that hot though. This one. It's very strong. It tastes like it's good. I would put this shit on some fucking like carne asada fries. Fuck yeah, I could put this on some carne asada fries all over that shit. Yeah. It's kind of lemony. I like lemony sauces, but I don't like too much of the V word in my sauce. You know the one. I don't like too much V word. I like more of a tang from lemon. It's very lemony. You know what I mean? I don't want too much of that V word flavor. No, no, not that V word. The one that if you like, like maybe if you had clever editing, you would then have like, uh, never mind. You know the one though. Uh, hey, thanks, thanks again. I tried this already, didn't I? It's good. I like it. It's not too hot. I'm gonna go up one more. Next one. This one is hot. It says hot on it. It's got a heart. It's called Marie Sharps. These all came in a pack, by the way. So I'm assuming that I went from bottom to the most hot, and now I'm kind of jumping around. Okay. Oh, excuse me. Yeah, it's red. The only green one was the one I just told you about. All the other ones are bright fucking nucle nuclear. Really bright red. I'm going to go for it. They all have a similar smell, which makes sense. That was the case with the other brand, too. But... There's this distinct difference between this one and the last few and the hottest one. In fact, I'm going to re-compare. The moment I smelled this Beware sauce, it instantly, like I said, the first thought that came to my mind was those times when you've been at a party and two people are fighting and you know not only do those two people have guns, but at least... 10 other fucking dudes in here have guns. So if this doesn't go well, maybe something could happen. That feeling you get in your gut when you know that's going to happen. Yeah, roof cholos. This guy knows. If, if there's, you know, these, someone looked at someone's girlfriend wrong. You know what I mean? That's the feeling I got when I sniffed this stuff. Yeah, that's crazy. Mm. It's like you, your nose, it, your nose is going to, it's warning you. Your nose is warning you. This smells like trouble. This smells like trouble. I'm not going to have any more of this. It burned my mouth. It burned my mouth straight up. It tasted like my mouth was burnt with heat, like physically you know what i mean burnt shit was burnt uh what's the name of this one it's the same brand it's called marie sharps beware comatose heat level habanero pepper sauce it's hot to me this would ruin food if you ask me, this would ruin food. Uh, 
Hot sauce for the weak willed? Yeah, Tapatio is my favorite. Dude, our girlfriend was like, Oh, I can't eat spicy food. It's too hot. You know, she's like acting like a gringo and shit. I was like, all right, fine. And then one time she ended up trying Tapatio and now she's like, oh, I like Tapatio. <laughs> Thank you. Tapatio is like pretty, like, dude, it's hot sauce. It's good. I think you, you might like it. Is what I'm saying. I don't know. It's my favorite. I like Tapatio. I love it with uh, mm, tamales. So good with tamales. Or, you know, lots of stuff. I think uh, I think Tapatio is good. But I think that if you can handle Tapatio, then you at least, you're all right. If you can't handle Tapatio, then like, like Char, my friend Char, this guy, if he even eats like anything spicy, he gets like the hiccups. Like he's, he gets drunk with spice. Not even something spicy, anything. Like, uh, he just gets, like, the hiccups. He starts to sound like Barney Gumble, you know? It's, like, super... <laughs> he can't speak and shit. It's pretty funny. He said some funny shit, like, while he's been on the hot sauce. He says funny shit. <coughs> anyway, uh... What was I talking about? Oh, yeah. I guess I could try this one now. There's three. No, there's only two left. One of them is hot. And the other one is fiery hot. So I guess it's clear which one's hotter. Uh, I guess I'll do hot first. I texted you a strat for hot sauce. Is that going to be nudes? <laughs> Anyway, whatever. Uh, uh, should I look at that? Better be nudes. <laughs> Better not be uh, someone's dick. I don't want to see that. Uh, anyway, I'm going to try this one. This is just regular hot. I'm going in. Uh, it's good. I like this. I kind of like all of these. It's just that the one that's really hot is too hot. It's good. Are you drinking them? Nice capital letters, bitch. What the fuck do you think I'm doing? What do you want? What do you want? Fuck you, dude. I fucking can't stand these capital letter. The first thing you say in here is a capital letter question. You know this stuff's fucking hot, right? You think I'm going to put up with you? I don't even put up with you when I'm not dealing with this kind of fucking shit. All right? Don't, don't, don't get me started, dude. <laughs> Thank you. All right? No fucking questions. Yeah, just chatting front pagers trying to jerk off. Fuck you. Go find someone else's mom to watch. Uh, it's hot. This stuff's hot. Every one of these is hot, <laughs> you know? It's just that some of them are mild. And I already fucking had the one that... The one that was hot. Which one did I just try? I'm gonna have some milk. I'm having milk. Uh, how do you feel about smoky sauces? <laughs> I love smoky sauces. I love... As long as it doesn't have too much of the B-word flavor. Mierda. Tapatia at any sun skillet dinner is right. I refilled on cum. Ugh. <laughs> <coughs> 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 Ah. Um. Hey, thanks, Nash Crap. Yeah, Tapatio's top. Thanks, Mickey Mouse and Rocco Ramon. Uh, let's see here. 
<laughs> yeah, the, all you. of these hot sauces basically were people who sent me a recommendation on Twitter. And especially if you, here's how it goes. If you recommend hot sauce and you link me to that shit on Amazon, chances are I'm going to buy it. If you just say, hey, try out Joey Jojo Jr. Shabadoo's hot sauce. It's delicious. I'm going to be like, yeah, all right. Push the heart button and then fucking, uh, yeah, whatever, kid. You think I'm going to go Google that dumb shit? Fuck you. Uh, but if you give me the link, I'll immediately, all right, I'll look at it. If it's not some kind of joke or some kind of like prank stuff, then I'll fucking check it out. Do you like sweet heat? I like anything delicious. I'm very open-minded when it comes to hot sauce. The only thing that I don't want is like apple cider v word flavor or heavy v word i keep fucking saying it you're just trying to get me to say that shit <laughs> thank you uh anyway give me the link on twitter though because right now i'm in the middle of a performance this is a bet award-winning performance i can't just get off stage and like uh you know interact with the studio audience and get a link you know this fucking uh, hot sauce is hot right i don't know if you know but i get irritable when i'm fucking dealing with this shit i'm irritable this stuff is hot <laughs> thank you uh thanks ghost of marn's diet and grin and grim and ghetto sith lord yeah they're tears of joi sure um, I'll try the last one. This is it. The final frontier. Marie Sharps. Marie Sharps. <laughs> Thank you. Habanero pepper sauce. Fiery hot. <laughs> Everything you. on the bottle is on fire. And there's a picture of this old ass lady on it. Marie Sharp. <laughs> that must be Thank her. You. <laughs> Thank you. Uh, thanks, Mo Seif and Ken Say Kim, Kaiser Ark, and Ivory Sleep. Thanks, bros. So anyway, basically, first of all, none of this shit is sponsored. <laughs> Thank you. Okay. Uh, it sucks that I have to like, f you know, say that, but it's true. None of this shit is sponsored, and I promise, all I wanted to do was splurge on hot sauce to find some that I can use on my food and get it up for a deal because it's tax deductible. So might as well try it in front of you guys so I can tell my tax man that they were like business expenses. Think about it, man. It's like a genius play. Anyway, I'm gonna try this stuff. The whistles got It smells fucking hot. Arasugan bat. Hey, thanks. Dixta. And thanks, Sil. Lil Sun Shower. Ah. I'm breathing the flames right now. And I feel like my eyes getting heavy. <laughs> uh, I'm just gonna rest my eyes. Sleeping face. Uh, um, what were we talking about? Hey, thanks, guys. Thanks, little sun shower. And everyone I didn't thank today, I really do appreciate all of you. Holy shit, this is fucking hot. All right, I'm going in. It's good. <laughs> It's good. Uh, not nearly as hot as the other one, but still really hot. It ramps. Oh, it ramps all the way up into the house. Open the door. It ramps up. It's because, you know what it is? The flavor is pleasant. The sauce tastes good. <laughs> Thank you. Once your mouth washes the flavor away, <laughs> what's Thank left you. is the aftermath. 
derelict. <laughs> Thank I mean, you. Just complete wasteland, <laughs> you know? You realize the damage Thank that's you. been done. Once the flavor is gone, it's so much more clear how hot it is. You know, also, I gotta say, I have like little flakes and like chunks throughout my mouth of probably all the different hot sauces that I've had today. <sighs> that one was good, though. That one was good. I think they were all good except for the beware one the beware one sorry bud this stuff it's too hot this will ruin food this will damage this will cause damage also i will be honest at this point i've been tasting this shit for what are we talking like two hours now it's causing trouble Ah, excuse me. And I'm talking about, I've got a soccer player kicking around field, field goals right now. South of the border. Uh, so I can't tell you how any of this shit will treat you. I'm not worried, but, you know, I'm not an idiot. I can feel that. That's a beautiful baby boy kicking around in there. It's about to be a xenomorph. Uh, this one's too hot. I guess I wish I didn't have this one and I would never have it again. I don't regret it. It's kind of nice to remember what it's like to have hot sauce that's too hot. This is too hot. This shit is going to damage your mouth to me. Either that or your mouth is already damaged. Previously damaged mouth. But all the rest of them, I could say that they're all pretty good. And my favorite hot sauce of the day easily was this one. In fact, I want to retry it, but man, I'm concerned that I'm... Uh, uh, All right, let's try it. I want to retry it. No, no, not Billy Zine. This is the Palo Alto Firefighters Habanero Pepper Sauce. This is the good <laughs> stuff. Thank you. It's my favorite one. It's the Mama Bear flavor. There was a there was a regular pepper sauce. This is Habanero Pepper Sauce, and then there was Ghost Pepper Sauce. The Ghost Pepper Sauce wasn't too hot, but it had a little bit of a V word flavor. For me, I don't love that. This one is much smokier. It's got like a Chipotle kind of smoke to it. I want to try it again because right now it was my favorite. Yeah, it's nice. It's got such a nice scent. Odor is like a, it's got a bite to it and it's smoky. It smells like roasted peppers maybe. Chipotle. <laughs> Thank you. Very nice smell. Delicious. Delicious. That is a home run. So, wow, it's pretty good. Pretty hot. I would say... Out of all the things I tried today, at best, other than that sauce, they were all whatever. Expensive as fuck. All these fucking things were expensive as fuck. This was like 20 bucks, dude. This weak ass, sorry ass mustard was 20 bucks. And it was so whack. I'm going to give it to my mom. It just tastes like fucking bourgeoisie gray poupon. Like, like it's just some trying to be a, like, you know, fancy feast. Trying to be bourgeoisie. 
You know what I mean? It was a ripoff. This stuff sucks. Uh, everything else. I like this ketchup. This Chipotle ketchup. It's called Melinda's Chipotle ketchup. I like it. I think it's better than ketchup. Uh, but at the end of the day, it is just ketchup. And I don't think it's anything that special. But it is better. I wouldn't jump for joy. I would say it's solid. Uh, oh, especially if you like ketchup. Uh, so I'll give that to my mom. Yeah, my mom <laughs> likes great coupons, so uh, she'll appreciate it. And then after that is basically all of these Marie Sharp flavors. It was a six pack. And I think I like the Mama Bear ones. Like, the the <laughs> green one Thank and the you. mild ones were good, but too mild. And the hot ones were too hot. Mama Bear is just right, you know? I think the Mama Bear ones were perfect. I've had Devil's Spit. It's good. Devil's Spit is good. Isn't that Famous Dave's? Is that what you're talking about? Uh, what the fuck? Someone shoot this guy. Hey, don't talk to me, man. I ain't trying to talk to you. Uh, what were we talking about? Damn, dude, this hot sauce is fucking with me. I feel like drunk almost. Like my head. <laughs> Thank you. And my eyes. I'm afraid to touch my face, even though I was so careful. I shouldn't worry. Don't worry. You are very careful. You'll be fine. I was totally careful. My hands are clean. I didn't touch anything. Someone just got shot for like 170,000 seconds. <sighs> what was I talking about? Yeah, I can feel it for sure. My mouth right now. Immediate. You know, red flags. My mouth, my nose. And then secondary, the top of my head feels sweaty. And after that, my stomach doesn't hurt, but I can tell it's like the calm. There could be a jihad later. It's possible that the future, you know, there could be a jihad in my future. I could have a holy war south of the border. Ooh, it's possible. <laughs> um, man, it's hard to stay focused because of so much going on, and I don't usually stream while I'm eating hot food. Sorry about the sniffles. Uh, Thanks for looking out for the Grinks community. The what? <laughs> hey, thanks, Thank Tapatio you. Official and Deplight. Thanks, Clam Hat and Brosta Sauce, Bro Dewer, Sire Spoon and Sir Soapy, Nash Crap and Bloodstone Thunder, Kaishin, White Shadow, and Lil Sun Shower. Thanks for gifting all those subs, and thanks, everybody, for the generosity. <coughs> wow, man. Uh, when, our, when it was girlfriend season, we were eating Indian food, and I ordered spicy chicken biryani from my favorite Indian place. And I always say very spicy, but they don't always listen, you know, because they're worried that um, it'll be too hot and I'll write a bad review, but they listened this time. Uh, that spicy biryani that I got from, from that day, it was so hot. It was crazy spicy. And I would say that the only thing spicier than that that I had today was the beware sauce the comatose b 
beware comatose heat levels. That sauce was spicier than the biryani. Other than that, though, that biryani was insane. I was eating it, trying to not look like a bitch in front of our girlfriend, but I was still crying. I mean, tears of J-O-I just, like, pouring. That shit was fucking hot, and it was good. It was really good. Delicious. So you wanted to keep going, but it was ramping up. Holy moly. Mm, anyway. <sighs> that was, I think, overall, I would say that was a pretty big success. The downsides were, it cost me like, some money, but that's the, like, I feel like I was opening divination cards here. You know, I'm like, I'm trying to see if I can hit a jackpot. I'm willing. And the fact that I could, you know, maybe I could do other stuff. Who knows? I'm in the lab here. I'm writing, I'm working on thinking of new scripts because video games these days have been really <laughs> disappointing me. <Thank> you. <laughs> and the most exciting shit that I have to get excited about are remakes. Fucking Demon Souls remake, Diablo 2 remake, uh, Silent Hill remake, Metal Gear 1 remake. If I mean that the basically the whole point here is that if it's not going to be a remake, that means it's going to be using the predatory style of game design. <laughs> Why you. would you make a new game? Yeah, Dead Space remake. Why would you make a new game and not have it be predatory? You know, what are you, an idiot? Hello? If you don't, you know what everyone says about devs? <laughs> everyone shits on devs. No one appreciates developers. Everyone hates them, talks shit. You know, they don't get the credit they deserve. They work their asses off and all they do is fucking whine. You know, fuck devs, right? You're with me on that. Devs are bitches. They fuck everything up. They ruin everything. They don't know what they're doing. They're not in touch. They're bitches. Fuck them. If they wanted to eat, they shouldn't have been devs. And we all agree on that, right? So if you were them, why would you not put predatory shit in the game? These fans are bitches. Fuck these guys. They don't appreciate anything I do. I'm going to make this cash shop fucking milk every one of Lucari's titties until he's got dust. And that's how they're going to make the games. Why wouldn't they? It makes so much more money. It's just going to be way smarter. So there, it's not like a fucking, oh, I don't have to be a scientist to figure out why video games suck. They suck because we suck. And we're so stupid. We keep buying them. Why do they make Assassin's Creed's every year, dude? It's your fucking fault. And that includes me. I never buy that shit, though. That was your fault. Who the fuck's buying this shit? They make Assassin's Creed's every year because of you. They made Watch Dogs Part 3. Watch Dogs Part 3. Because of you. Anyway, uh, man, hot sauce fucking gets you wired up. Jesus. Oof. Video games are trash, man. I'm working on new script types. This one was a hit. I enjoyed it. I got to try out lots of hot sauce. I got to potentially damage my hearing. Hopefully not permanently. Um, and, you know, good times. I enjoyed that. I'm going to get up and pace around the house for a while and then decide whether or not I need to take an emergency shit. I think I'll be fine though. Honestly, I'll keep you up to date. Uh, thanks Plompkin and Cal Reg and Bumbercules and Deplight and Aelstrom. Thanks, bros. <laughs> Thank you. You know, at the end of the day, it all comes down to fishing. Just like Dio Hazuki said. Thanks very much for tuning in. 
And it really doesn't matter what the script is as long as we're both able to in enjoy each other's company so that this always feels like a hobby and never feels like a job, even though I'm able to tax write off all these fucking hot sauces. Sweet. I'm going to wrap this shit up. Thanks, a beat, my meat. Maybe if I feel like talking, I'll come back later tonight and play some POE at night, but no promises. Whew, my burps are flaming. Explosive. <sighs> Have a good one, amigos. Thanks again. What'd you say? Game design is low-key brain surgery and devs are permageniuses. Uh, you would think that leaving messages that are not whack is low-key brain surgery, but uh, it really isn't. All you gotta do is keep it down. You're my favorite streamer, smile. It's very simple. Uh, anyway, thanks to Patch. I'm off the clock, though. I do appreciate it. You guys have a good one, will ya? See ya in the sewer. Thanks again. Take it easy.